covering 1.4 million cases of inpatient and 3 million cases of outpatient services. This in turn saved Kenyan households approximately 54.9 billion in financial losses brought about by health-related issues. With a monthly subscription of Kenya shillings 500, the NHIF SupraCover has become Kenya's largest and most reliable, accessible, and affordable medical insurance cover. Over the last eight years of my administration, NHIF's membership has steadily grown. So far, the total NHIF membership stands at 10.5 million members, up from just 4 million members in 2013. Mr. Speakers, I acknowledge with appreciation that the National Assembly recently passed the National Hospital Insurance Fund Amendment Bill 2021, and the same is now presently before the Senate. I today urge through you, Mr. Speaker, that the Senate expedite the consideration of this bill so that in the life of this House, we can all join in ushering in universal health coverage for all our people. Mr. Speaker, honorable members, let us tear down the barriers that inhibit our quest to deliver quality health care for all Kenyans. To improve the standard of health care facilities, my administration has boosted bed capacity, improved access to medical equipment, and increased the number of medical training schools. In 2013, for example, the total bed capacity in public health facilities stood at 56,000 hospital beds. This has increased by 47% to 82,000 hospital beds in 2020. The northeastern region of our country has experienced the highest expansion in hospital bed capacity, up from 2,443 hospital beds in 2013 to 4,506 566 hospital beds in 2021. This is followed by the Nyanza region, which has experienced an expansion in bed capacity of 63% from 9,249 hospital beds in 2013 to 15,054 hospital beds in 2020. Nairobi has also experienced an expansion of 57% from 7,866 hospital beds in 2013 to 10,399 hospital beds in 2021. Through the Managed Equipment Service Project, my administration has supplied 1,241 pieces of specialized medical equipment with 